Hello everybody and welcome to this appetizer for my new online program on Seda, the old Nordic tradition of shamanism. My name is Annette Hust and uh, the old Nordic traditions of both magic and spirituality has uh, been uh, like my speciality for 30 plus years. In fact, in all the time I have been studying practicing, teaching, shamanism. This online program that I call Seder, History, Craft and Modern Practice, is a, a way for me to communicate, to share, to, um, yeah, to share with you everything I have gathered and, and learned in my uh, many years of, of, of research and research both of the old older written sources, the old Norse sources and the both older and newer research combined with what I have learned from a lot of people in in the many many circles. I have been uh, both uh, teaching the practice of Seda but also where we have had uh, wonderful talks and discussions what I call the magic university in a, in a very modest way and the uh, Magic University could also describe this new program um, because it consists of, um, if you sign up for the program, there is both uh, eight videos that are for free and each video is connected to or followed by a, a question and answer, um, a session, a meeting on Zoom for, for people who have booked their place there. And uh, if you are part of the, the Zoom meeting there, this gives you a, a, a unique opportunity to, uh, through more question and answer relating to the topic of, uh, of the video, to go deeper into the sources and to relate what we learn from the sources, from the history and whatnot, to how does that inform your own modern practice, whether it be nature-based shamanism or seder or, or other traditions. Um, so I call it university because it's, it focuses on knowledge. I, if you, you are also very welcome and uh, I have you in my thoughts, if you are the kind who also just want to uh, dive more critically into the sources and a uh, new question, maybe challenge some of the theories and notions about Seder. We're certainly going to look at a few. Um, and you might want to be interested even without having any desire to practice yourself, but you're just more interested on a more intellectual uh, level. Um, during the eight talks and following uh, Zoom meetings, we will look at both some of the some of the most, should we say, informative and, and exciting uh, stories from the sagas uh, and the, the poetic Edda. Uh, um, some famous, uh, we, we will meet some of those most known uh, performers of Seda uh, from the sagas and also a few from real history some that we have only met through what we have found in their graves from the 10th century or thereabouts. And um, later we will especially uh, look at the ritual tools and also maybe challenge our own view of Seda, of the Seda performers, especially the female Seda performer called the Vulva and uh, the way it is presented to us as part of the Viking Age. Um, so. I look very much forward to meet you in the discussions.